Understanding idioms. I'm in stitches. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today, we're going to explore a very interesting and amusing English idiom. I'm in stitches. Idioms are a crucial part of mastering a language because they add color and expressiveness to our conversations. So, if you're ready to add another idiom to your English toolkit, let's dive right in. The phrase, I'm in stitches, has nothing to do with sewing or needles. In fact, it's a way to express that something is extremely funny or hilarious. When someone says they're in stitches, it means they are laughing so hard that their side hurts as if they were stitched up. It's a vivid way to describe that you find something incredibly amusing. Understanding the origin of an idiom can often help us remember it better. The expression, I'm in stitches, dates back to the early 17th century. It comes from the physical side effects of laughing too hard. When we laugh intensely, our stomach muscles can contract, causing a stitch-like sensation similar to the one experienced by runners. Hence, being in stitches became synonymous with laughing uncontrollably. To grasp the usage of, I'm in stitches, let's look at some examples. 1. The comedian was so funny, I was in stitches the whole night. 2. Did you see that new comedy movie? It left me in stitches from start to finish. 3. Whenever I'm with my best friend, we always end up in stitches sharing old stories. Notice how the phrase is used to emphasize the intensity of the laughter and the enjoyment of the situation. This idiom is informal, so it's best used in casual conversations, texts, or social media. It's perfect for describing a funny event or joke, recalling a humorous memory with friends, reacting to a funny movie, show, or stand-up comedy. However, it's not suitable for formal contexts, like business meetings or academic writing. And that's a wrap on the idiom, I'm in stitches. Next time you find yourself laughing uncontrollably, you'll have the perfect English phrase to describe your amusement. Remember, mastering idioms not only makes you sound more like a native speaker but also enriches your communication with colorful expressions. Keep laughing and learning, and I hope this video has stitched a smile onto your face.